Let's go to 1 Thessalonians 5 and 17. Pray without ceasing. Let me tell you a story. For some odd reason this morning, I was really feeling down, really strange. And I was thinking to myself, why am I feeling down? Because normally I don't really feel down. Like the majority of the time, I won't say that I am always happy, but I guess I can say that I am content. But this morning, I was really feeling down. And it wasn't really about the bad things that are happening to me. I don't know. I guess my mindset, it is kind of hard to explain. I guess I was having negative thoughts about certain things, I guess. Anyways, so what came to my mind is to pray. And I started to pray about it. I started to pray to God, telling him to take away that feeling that I had over me, that I guess you can call it like a depressive type of feeling. And I was praying and praying about other things and stuff like that. And after I got done praying, I felt better. So you may be going through the same thing. You may be feeling down as well. You may be worried about things. So what you can do, you can pray about it and God is going to take that weight off of you. But keep in mind, make sure you are following the rules and regulations of the Bible. Make sure that you are not being disobedient to God. Because we all have to know that demons are going to try to attack you always. They are. But it was really strange for me to feel down. <laughs> like really, really down. Very strange. So this means that we always have to be watchful. We always have to be watchful and put our trust in God and not on other people. Now, it is okay to trust other people, but what I am trying to say, we should not place a person where God should be. Does that make any sense? Like we should not put our full hope and trust in people where we should only place our full hope and trust in God. Does that make any sense? So we are substituting God for a human being when a human being cannot do what God does. I really hope that makes sense. Because when you put your full trust and hope in people, as humans, we are going to let each other down, meaning that we are going to fail each other. Does that make any sense? So, I know many people are feeling down right now, or I assume. So what you can do is pray and keep praying until you feel better. And don't focus on negative issues. You can even play Christian music as well. Just don't dive deeper and deeper in that depression. I really hope that makes sense. So prayer always work. Make sure you are obedient to God. Before you pray, what you should do 
is repent of your sins. So say, God, please forgive me of all my sins. Because God is not going to consider, according to the Bible, God is not going to consider a sinner's prayer unless you repent first. Makes sense, right? God bless.